Have you guys heard about the mysterious Shopkin? The what? The mysterious Shopkin. He appears from the shadows helping Shopkins in need. Like a superhero. Kind of sounds far-fetched to me. What do you think, Kooky? No, it's true. I saw him myself. I was playing with Mimi when... Ah! And when I opened my eyes, I saw the caped shadow flying off in the distance. Burnt bagels and breadcrumbs. That was close. He saved you, too? I didn't know you had seen the mysterious Shopkin, too. What happened? Well, I was cleaning when this dust cloud came out of nowhere. Oh, 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 you saved me. Thank you so much. Wait, who are you? How do I get down? I was stuck up there for a whole day. Too bad you didn't see who it was. I'd really like to thank them. Well, you never know. Maybe it's a shoppy we know. That's true. Got any ideas on who it could be, Cookie? Where did she disappear to? Maybe she's the mysterious Shopkin. <laughs> <laughs> no, no way. way. Check you later. is gonna be awesome! Plus, we're gonna stay awake for the first time until midnight! Midnight? Oh, that means I'll only get... 14 hours of beauty sleep! I'll start to look like all of you! Hey, what's that supposed to mean? Oh, uh, nothing! Eight hours. <sighs> I'm, like, already kind of tired just thinking about that. Don't yawn! Because if you yawn, I'll yawn! Uh, uh, oh... Stay strong, Cheeky! You're about to set off a chain reaction of yawning! The fate of this evening lies in your mouth. It's only 3 p.m. Plus, there's still a few things we need to do before the party tonight. I've written up a list of tasks for everyone to complete. What are you organizing, Apple? That! Now we can have a big New Year's Eve countdown! Who wants to see a 30-foot minute hand? Oh, yeah, Sounds awesome! That is Absolutely! That'd be so cool! So, like, does time go slower because the clock is so bad? Still the same speed, Susie. Since you ruined Christmas for me, I'm gonna ruin New Year's for you! <laughs> Great <sighs> party, Apple. Hang in there, Susie. Not too long to go now. Ah! Happy New Happy Year! New Year. Ah! Why are you all screaming? That's what you asked for, silly. I have to say, Apple, I'm not a fan of all this screaming. Makes me feel like a common garden weed. Spaghetti in the hole! Lippy with Lippy. Do you know how hard it was to find a spaghetti cannon? It's not exactly a household item, Apple. What are you all looking at? Why, why, why would you do this? That's what you asked for. Earthworks. Fireworks. I asked for streamers, a confetti cannon, and fireworks. Let me see that list. Hey, somebody changed this! We're sorry, Apple. At least we still have the countdown clock. Hey guys, it's nearly time. 10, 9, 8, 7! What's that noise? I knew we shouldn't have stayed up this late. Where did the clock go? Uh, I don't know. Hey! You think it's been longer than 10 seconds? Probably. Well, Happy New Year, I guess. Okay, Strawberry, let's try this again. 
You ready? Ready. Fold the paper in half, staple four times, fold this bit here, add some butter, fold that bit there, turn upside down, fold the wings down, bend the wingtips back up, do the hokey pokey, and voila! The perfect paper plane! Easy! Now, your turn. Fold the paper in half, staple two times, fold these bits there, dip it in butter, turn it around, bend the bendy bits back, add some hokey pokey, and voila! Uh, at least it has wings! Coming through, guys! Get ready for takeoff! Forget my plane in the sky! Woo! Ah! Apple! What do I do? I know how to make them! I don't know how to fly them! Uh, hold on to the sides and lean left and right to turn! Woo! Nice work, Strawberry! Phew! Oh no! Woo! <laughs> Love is in the air. Phew. Oh. Check you later. Shopkins, Shopkins. I'm so excited. I can't believe it's my birthday already. I wonder what the other Shopkins have planned for me. Hey, Cheeky. What are you up to? Nothing. Oh, do you want to come to Shopville with me? I'm busy. You're busy doing uh, nothing? Uh, yeah. Oh, I guess I'll leave you to it. I can't believe she forgot my birthday. Busy making you an awesome birthday cake. <laughs> Hi, Apple. What are you looking for? Supplies. Supplies? Do you need candles? Why would I need candles? The lights are working just fine. If anything, they're a little too bright today. I guess they are a little bright. But not as bright as your birthday candles. Let me guess, you're busy too. Uh, I'm not busy. I'm like a cray cray busy. Oh, do you even know what day it is today? International Shoelace Day? <sighs> and your birthday. Worst birthday ever. Happy, Happy birthday! birthday! No! <laughs> I love, love, love my birthday surprise! I can't believe you guys planned this together for me! Uh, totally. totally! Sure did! Yeah. Here's the cake! Hey guys, why is the floor so icy? Happy birthday, Strawberry! <gasps> Best birthday ever! Check you later! Shopkins, Shopkins! We need your help! Cookie Cookie is missing! Okay, where was the last place you saw Cookie? We were inside the Small Mart. I received a call from Lippy, but when I returned, she was gone. Cheeky Watson, we have one hour to find Cookie before it's too late! Oh no, why is that? I've got a dance class with Susie. I hope she's okay. Don't worry, Strawberry. We'll crack this case wide open. And we just got a step closer to solving it. Okay, it was me. I knew it. So, where's Cookie? Huh? I don't know where Cookie is. I thought you guys were talking about the mess. I ran away because I didn't want you guys to think I was so clumsy all the time. Too late for that. Then where on earth is... Hey, guys. Cookie, okay. where have you been? Shop though. Oh, why didn't we think to look there? This get up in that heat? No, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Check you later. Dressing up as Rudolph this year, Cheeky? No, I fell face first into a bowl of cherries. You mean my cherries? I needed those, Cheeky. I know we need to move as quick as we can, but try to be careful, guys. How's the snow going, Susie? OMG, it's a winter wonderland in here. This snow is, like, super swirly, though. That's whipped cream, Susie. So that means I've served my pie with a side of 
can the snow. How classy. We need help, Apple. We've got so much food to prepare before Christmas Day, not to mention everything else that needs to be done. Hey, gang, what's all the fuss? Hey, Fleur, it's the Christmas rush. Guys, I think I let this sit too long and now it's turned to mush. Sorry, Fleur, we're a little stressed. I'll say you've made a mess. From the stuffing to the pudding, the list just never ends. There is no need to stress when you've tried to do your best. All you need is good old-fashioned help from your friends. We'll cook a Christmas feast filled with all sorts of treats. A really yum selection of savories. And sweets. What's that? It's really tasty. It's custard baked in pastry. Mm, you guys have got to taste this gravy. Sarah Tlithicus. While we help you hang the ribbon, guys, I don't know what I'm doing. Just follow what is written. I'll take care of the chopping. While we hang up all the sacking. Just be careful in the kitchen, because the sink is not clogging. Once we finish baking. We'll help with decorating. I spilled sauce on me. Don't forget to wear your apron. We'll be done in time for dancer. Dasher, fix, and prancer. Uh, who, like, ate the food we left for Santa? Sorry, I feel awful. As long as you're remorseful. All this food makes me hungry. <gasps> nope, nope, that's a bauble. We finished all the cooking! From the stuffing! To the pudding! Now it's time to hang the star! Just, Just be, be careful, careful of your footing! Your We've done our shopping spree! Wrap the gifts under the tree! Now we can finally relax! <laughs> but you forgot about me! Uh, hi. What are you doing? What are we doing? What are you doing? Well, it's my birthday coming up, so I'm shopping for a new purse. I think it came from this direction. Mm. Now my hand smells like cherry cupcakes. You know, a clock that size would be better suited in a central location. Would you like some help repositioning it? We're hiding it. <laughs> Oh, from who? My friends. I mean, a group of acquaintances. Acquaintances who couldn't even remember to get me a Christmas gift. You better not tell. Act natural. I won't. Because I'm going to give you the chance to make things right. Hey, you, Cupcake. You look guilty of, of, of something. Hey, stop accusing my friends of stealing. Your friends? Of course, Yolanda. Speaking of that, why aren't you wearing the bracelet we got you for Christmas? What do you mean? Lippy, did you put Yolanda's bracelet in her stocking? Uh, sorry, Toasty and I were still braiding it on Christmas morning. It's a friendship bracelet. Oh. <laughs> Merry belated Christmas. We're gonna keep looking for our clock. Let me know if you see anything. Will do. <gasps> <sighs> Morning, everyone. Ugh, what time is this? <sighs> 7.30. <gasps> Wait a minute! Guys, it's back! What's it counting down to? It's too early for the next New Year's. I'm sorry your New Year's was ruined in the worst way. So instead, let's count down Jessie Cake's birthday. What a great How idea. Cool. Oh, so awesome. Awesome. This is such a lovely gesture. Oh, wait. There's another card inside. Every birthday party needs a cake and a Kate. Somebody wants you to have a special birthday. Any idea who it is? I have a few ideas. later.
What are you up to, Apple? I'm teaching Milkbud new tricks. Milkbud, shake. Oh! Good boy, Milkbud. He got the right shake this time. Oh! Yay! What else can he do? He can do everything. Milkbud, sit. Roll over. Speak. Oh, oh, speak French. Oh, bonjour. Je m'appelle Milkbud. Oh. Make a balloon animal. Bud. What is X when 2X equals 5 billion to the power of infinity divided by the distance between shuffle and the moon minus the stick of butter plus Cookie's favorite number? Yeah! Woo! And now, the most difficult trick of all. Fetch the stick! Sacre bleu! Close enough, I guess. <laughs> Check you later. Shopkins, Shopkins. Shopkins! It's the campaign event you've all been waiting for. The Great Shopville today. Live from the Toy Store. Featuring your two favorite candidates, Apple Blossom and Yolanda Yo-Yo. Remember, if you get nervous, just smile. Being a leader is 90% confidence and 25% skill. I'm not confident in that math. That's the spirit. Now let's see that smile. I feel more nervous just looking at you. Okay, Yolanda just rolled in. Try to act natural. Hi, I'm Blossom Apple. I, I mean, hey, Apple Blossom. It is such a pleasure to finally meet you. Oh, uh, you too, Yolanda. Hey, can we talk for a moment? Sure. If I told you a secret, would you tell anyone? No, I would never share it with anyone. Okay, I'm like super nervous about the debate today. I'm super nervous too. Don't worry, the debate will be all in good fun. I think we're on. Good luck. Good luck. Thank you so much. You are our hero. Okay, Shopkins, without further ado, let's give our candidates a chance to tell us why we should vote for them to become the first mayor of Shuffle! Uh, hello, I'm Apple Blossom. <laughs> I'm so sorry, am I hurting you? <laughs> Just kidding. Apple, tell us why we should vote for you. Well, I consider myself to be an upstanding citizen of Shopville. I promise to lead with honesty and integrity. Yolanda, why should we take yes for the yo-yo come election day? Well, I really understand the value of sharing with your fellow Shopkins, unlike Apple Blossom. That's right, Apple refuses to share her toy. When I asked her if I could play with her remote-controlled speedboat, this is what she said to me. No, I would never share it with anyone. Gulls, but I don't even own a toy speedboat. Okay, okay. Uh, I think that's enough for today. Let's thank our two candidates for coming. I can't believe she would make that up about me. Don't worry about it. We know that's not the type of Shopkin you are. Who's that? So, Fortune Stella, will I win the election or do I need to be even sneakier? Ask again later. Will you even answer my question later? Ask again later. Uh, who cares? I'm gonna win. And when I'm a mayor, I'm gonna pass this bill requiring everybody to dress and act just like me. I don't care what you are. A shoe, lipstick, an apple. I'm gonna turn everybody in Shopville into yo-yos. <laughs> Ask again later.
Hey, Apple, we're really sorry about your clock. I didn't even realize what was happening. I should be more attentive. You know what? That'll be my New Year's resolution. That and reading an entire book. I'm going to clean out my closet. I'm going to get fit. I might take a nap and figure my resolution out later. Oh, wait. I'm, like, totally going to stop napping. Uh, I feel like I've heard all of this already. Okay, time to clean out my closet. Although I am hungry. Yeah, I could go with sandwich. After lunch, I might go shopping. We've never finished any of our resolutions. You know, we didn't technically see the clock strike 12, so it's not the new year yet. I say we make a pact to finish our resolutions before the clock is found. That may not take long, Cheeky. Mayor Cookie has the best Shopkins on the job. Chicken chip, reporting for, for duty. duty. Ugh, not these two little biscuits again. <laughs> you might have more time than I thought, Cheeky. Come on, Chip. We've got work to do. Shh. Okay. Chapter one. Hey, Cheeky, can you help me train? I'm trying to finish my resolution, Toasty. But I need you to help me finish my resolution. Okay, let's place anything that's old in the to-go pile on my bed. I can't be in here, Olipi. Your bed is, like, really making me want to take a nap. Well, don't fall asleep, because I need you to help me finish my resolution. We, we need your help! Keep up the pace, Toasty, and you'll be fit in no time. You get to read, Susie isn't near a bed, Toasty gets to work out, and my closet gets cleaned. Everybody wins. Did you hear that? It can only mean one thing. A fire! The clock! Oh, yeah, I mean the clock. I guess I can always start my New Year's resolution tomorrow. Uh, okay.